To create an assignment that is simply a column in the gradebook, you can go into Assignments, go to the group that you want it to be in, hit the plus, and here you would name the assignment. You do want it to be a file type of assignment. Name the assignment to be what you want it to be. So this may be, for instance, a assignment that is extra credit or something like that. We'll deal with extra credit in another video, but this is often where you're having people do something um, and you're just giving them points for physically doing something and there's nothing to submit or anything like that. So here you again can specify the due date the number of points, go to more options, and here maybe it's participation in an event or something like that that you're doing. You can change the number of points as well in this spot you've got points you've got the assignment group that it's going to be in how i'm going to grade it that might even be a complete incomplete especially in this case does it count towards the final grade and because we're doing a uh, just a column in the grade book notice i said that nothing needed to be handed in we're going to do no submission. If you want them to hand in a piece of paper, specify the on paper. The reason for that is because it will it will show the student that this is on paper. There is a submission, but it, it, you're not submitting through Canvas. I'll show you what that looks like in just a little bit. You've got the ability to have this be a great a group assignment. Require peer reviews when it's available from and until. Often in this case, it's going to be a specific date and time anyway. So maybe this is on the 23rd because that's the day of class at 1 p.m. Well, then the available and the until can all be exactly the same thing. All right. Then you go ahead and you can hit save. In this case, you can even hit publish because there's nothing else to it. Notice here it says submitting nothing. If I want to change that, and this goes back to what I was saying before with the submission type, you can have on paper. And then if I hit save, the submission type is submitting on paper. So that's where you want to make sure your description is descriptive. Your instructions are descriptive on how to, on what you want on what your students should be doing, that type of thing. So this is where you can go in and create, this is how you create a gradebook column in assignments. To demonstrate what that means is under grades here, you now see a file upload assignment and then this gradebook column out of five. This is that assignment that I just showed you that I just created. Notice it says, it does not say that it's not published. Ergo unpublished. This one I showed earlier, that one is unpublished. Because this is published, it actually has the ability to put in a grade.